Now we're going to find out what the law says should be the qualifications of not only the secretary of the DICT, but all the undersecretaries and the assistant secretaries. Alam nyo yung DICT, yung Department of Information and Communications Technology, is the only department I know Two years who now. has qualifications for secretary, even undersecretary, assistant secretary. You know, he has to be a citizen and with at least seven years of competence and expertise in any of the following information and communications technology, all having to do with cyberspace, right? Information technology service management, information security management, cyber security, obviously, data privacy, e-commerce, or human capital development, in, hindi lang human capital development, but human capital development in the ICT sector. Ito lang ang nakikita kong may, 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 may specific qualifications. Hindi lang pwedeng ah, gusto ko, yung kaibigan ko, if I'm the president, you know, I like this person, I owe this person something. It's very specific. Now, do you think, given this, given these requirements, are you qualified? I've been with the uh, ICT business, ma'am, since uh, 1971, when I passed the first board examination to be given to um, electronics and communication. In other words, you are saying you not only have seven years of competence, you have uh, 71, just go, 48 years? Yes, ma'am. That has been my profession. Uh, uh, Ever in my, since. In my uh, military life, I've been uh, always uh, with the uh, Signal Corps uh, or our communication electronics and information system of the armed forces. Tinanggap na ni Senator Gringo Onasa ng alok ni Pangulong Duterte na pamunuan ang DICT. Ang problema natin dito is is Senator Onasan who is supposedly going to be the secretary or he was or he said he was going to accept or whatever. Do you think he is qualified? If I may give some history on that. Uh, yes, when, please. When uh, uh, Secretary Rudy Salalima, when he resigned, the president offered the post to um, Senator Greg Hunasa, no? Ah, even then? Yes, ma'am. I was uh, just made as OIC, no? Mm -hmm. So when he resigned, it was already offered then to, but uh, Greg, I think, begged off because he uh, said, uh, Mr. President, allow me to finish my my term as senator, no, that was, he still has about more than one year to go then. The president uh, acceded to that request and I was made uh, acting muna. So that was the whole plan. Greg Gunasan, ma'am, I, I know him very well because we were very close really in the armed forces. He's uh, an intelligence man. Uh, he's an so intelligence man. Yes, ma'am. And, and also he's an intelligent man, but he is not competent in information and communications technology. Yes or no? I have very great respect for Secretary Unasan, yes. right? But I don't think, I mean, given that the law, Republic Act 10844, 844. creating the department, awesome is so specific about the qualifications, not only of the secretary, but of the undersecretary, assistant secretary, just go. Don't you think that's unfair to the Filipino people who want really, nakalagay dito, that the information and communications technology can contribute to the growth of GDP in a country, anywhere from something or something like that. And, uh, and what do you say of our information and tech communications technology now compared to the other countries? We are not in the top, ma'am. We are somewhere in the bottom, really. We are in the bottom. Okay. And this telco is one way of increasing the uh, competition and improving the service to the Filipino people. And it needs somebody who is going to follow up and make sure that all these uh, telcos behave properly 
But Personally, ma'am, yes. I, I serve at the place of the uh, president. Of course. And uh, in fact, I'm already thankful that uh, I was designated as acting secretary. But that's a big, uh, you know, that's a big uh, honor for me. But already. for the DICT to to operate properly, according to the law, it needs the leadership with competence. So thank you very much, General wow. Rio. Thank I <laughs> sincerely hope that, uh, that the DICT have the competence that it needs.